Ukraine took unexpected steps to turn tide in its war with Russia. Attacks on targets inside Russia are a sign of Ukraine's concerns regarding the resilience of the West. That's why President Volodymyr Zelensky is taking a big risk in order to turn the tide of the war and preserve his political position in Ukraine, writes Time. The article says that voters in America and Europe who support Ukraine both militarily and financially are increasingly disagreeing on whether Ukraine is able to regain control of 18% of its territory. The publication writes that even if the US Congress approves an increase in military aid for 2024, it is likely to be Washington's last aid package until after the November elections. Meanwhile, problems in Germany and opposition of Hungary make it difficult to fill the military aid gap. At the same time, Kremlin chief Vladimir Putin is reportedly putting the Russian economy on a war footing. Ukraine, on the other hand, is considering mobilizing additional 500,000 servicemen. Even if that turns out to be possible, it won't help in the war against the invader with a much larger population and economy. According to journalists, Kyiv is now doing everything it can to expand domestic defense production, especially of drones, for fighting and hitting targets inside Russia. There may also be an increase in the elimination of Russian officials and strikes against occupied Crimea. This, in turn, will provoke more intense Russian attacks on Ukrainian cities. Any of these attacks, and there are many possible targets, carries the risk of retaliation from Putin, leading to more direct NATO involvement in the conflict. Neither Russia nor NATO wants such an expansion, but wars begin to live their own lives. The material says, journalists write that Zelensky has become an unpredictable player. Recent attacks on facilities deep inside Russia were carried out with the help of weapons produced by Ukraine, Time notes.